it is narrated once that there was a majlis azah going on and in this majlis it was in someone's house in a scholar's house and the people came and they performed their matam their azah their majlis cried and they went back the scholar in the dream at night he sees said shuhada he sees said shuhada and he tells the angels said the shuhada sitting by the arsh he tells the malaika there was a majlis or a matam in my house at fulan scholar's place give me the list of all the people who participated in every possible way bring me their list bring me their names and enroll them into jannah ajeeb the malaika said jannah he said jannah they said everybody he said everybody the person who recited the majlis jannah the person who recited the the sha uh, the sha'ir the the poems the nauha or the marthia as we say it jannah the people who cried in the majlis jannah the people who pretended to cry jannah the people who were still grieved in their hearts but didn't cry give them jannah the people who cooked the food jannah the people who went to the markets to buy that food give them jannah the malaika went and recorded the list of all the people and they went back to say the shuhada with this list they said, yeah, Sayyidah Shuhada, these are the list of the people. Sayyidah Shuhada looked at the names. He said, no, you have forgotten somebody, go back. The Malaika went back. They looked across all the people. They said, yeah, we have recorded everybody. They went back to Sayyidah Shuhada. They said, yeah, Sayyidah Shuhada, this is everybody who participated in every aspect of the majlis. So Sayyidah Shuhada looks at the Malaika and he says that when the tea was being cooked, the flame went off and there was a woman who passed by the kitchen she saw that the fire has gone off and the tea is going cold so she removed a match box and removed one match from her pocket because she used this one match in my matam right for her jannah